Reckless. That is one scary early game, man. But Matilda Airlines taking us to Lana Dawn. Well, it is time. This is it. But they're already meeting. Wait, it's Kimi Jungle? Here. It's going to be. Ooh. Is Piaquito oh, side? What? Is people in trouble here? Haji is already going straight in for him. Double Flicker! Coming up. Oh, oh. In the first blood. Even Guys, the what is going on? Onyx losing their shit the or Blacklist coming back from Grave? Really They're in. pulling up he that brand jungle. strategy. Lower Smart bracket team. strategy. Smart What's going on here? From jungling. The thing is, Matilda was on the case already. And he did not respect that at all. Again, this is a mid lane, um, mid lane Cho. Who's actually yeah, that mid lane Cho has been like popping off. I thought it would have been like Kimi side. I mean, Kimi Kimi mid lane and Paquito jungle, but I guess not. I think they did that because it's Farsa Rafaela. Kimi's gonna have no prior at all, but Matilda Cho can. Those peanuts. Those peanuts. They hurt. You see that almost all of the lanes are getting won by Blacklist International, and that's very natural for this composition. But Esme can heal up pretty quickly. What they needed to do is just to clear the wave as fast as, as fast as possible. Maybe not go for the kills, but if they can get the kills, go for it. Just poke their opponents and get the objectives. They will take out the turtle this time. No trades from Onyx Esports. Blacklist whatsoever. going to the they upper bracket for their so revenge? Passively in this game. Oh, yeah, imagine PTK versus Blacklist again you know, in the upper bracket. Esports will be, you know, extra be passive. They know that they've got some great scaling on their side. But Blacklist International, are they going to take the initiative? They're going to love each other. After that and, uh, shit. He's been getting these killer instincts online very You guys long. again? What I do want to talk about is okay, the items again, we've just started again. Not, that not that Kimi with the jungle emblem, emblem. In the jungle. burst right. the well, shit out of that turtle. This is one of the heroes Free turtle. to beat yeah. here in your tier list. You've actually said that the Nathan is much better in the gold lane. Why do you think that Onyx is still trying to play this? Damn, game? Onyx jungle losing jungle. early game prior. Now, this is really just a style That's pretty for tough. the Onyx squads. They love farming and they know that they can get nice by cold with their steel. play. It is in the B tier because it's easy to contest. As you saw from Blacklist International, they already are trying to be aggressive against that Nathan. And hey, oh, Tick dog! Speaking of Ooh. aggressive... They're giving it to Oheb. They're giving it to Oheb. Ah, uh, GG's, bro, guys. It's over. It's over. Making sure keep like they're Lebron's losing like, back and forth, they're, they're losing every lane. These kills, even if you have to use big resources, the CW oh. was able to clear the minion wave by the way. So that's mm -hmm. that's also a play that you have to look when you go for the kills. Surely you'll get the kills, but you they will not be able to convert into a push. So, damn, this Kimmy doesn't even CW, go for the he took what he can get. Them, old crap. Why does Onyx so look like the randoms the versus Blacklist? That is just not not good right now for the side of Onyx Esports. 1.2 thousand gold lead for the side of Blacklist International. They actually and look Onyx like randoms. He's oh, oh my god! Edward finds him, but here comes no way it survives. Oh, yeah. Blue buff? Ooh! Barza oh, got it. He also okay. takes the purple buff at the same time. Very nicely done. Okay, okay, Drian came out to play. So far, um, back to back games with the hey, What is the sound delay? It still is a big lead for oh, it's not. It's not. Never but mind. This is as we expected it will be. Now, Wise is going to be able to take out the turtle. Is it? The second one at just 4 minutes and 22 seconds. Oh. Wait, Venus? Question mark? Way under that turret, Keyboy. He might be looking for a re-engage here. Oh, there we go. Oh! Oh! oh Balorski? Out of Oh My Venus as well. Balorski? That was really, really good for Onyx Esports. Able to bait some fights, and now Oheb is going to be zoned away. Haji, though, we know how lethal he is on this. Just him doing moves is making me scared, man. <laughs> I am. This is, he's not connecting onto anything, but I was just like, oh, God, not again, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you just yeah. see the G couldn't do it. You're just shaking. Yeah. <laughs> just keep on looking at his flicker. Please don't be out. Please don't be out. <laughs> <laughs> is that you, Balorski? Yeah, that's why Onyx Esports tried to make a move on on top, and we're going to get a replay. Oh, oh, hey, wait, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Oheb is alive. What is this replay? There, but looking back at this replay so oh my far, God. just doing really good. Did he die, Beatrix? Oh, he survived. Oh, okay. Well, so pixel perfect. Yep. See that. Uh, oh, I thought he would have died there. With the turtle buff under the Kimi, 
the ultimate was quite strong, and Boots know it might be stepping into a bad spot. <laughs> and it reads into the situation. Okay, all right, a bit of a, a bit of a potential bait there, but so far this purple buff, oh. uh, it's a little tough. It's Remember Blacklist last doing this shit on Hylos? Try to invade so much. Wait! Wait! <laughs> Haji is actually carrying the shit out of this, beating Oheb like crazy. This Clint is out of the game. He cannot do anything anymore. It's over. Beatrice is way too fast. It's either Clint is losing their shit or they're communicating really bad. Because it should be obvious. Cho is camping. Damn, Bla guys, Onyx is out. Blacklist is going up to the final again. Get the items onto Boots, get the attacking items for the Esmeralda, and then get the damage items for both Sands as well. CW, maybe they can uh, weather the storm and take it to the late game. But this shit's over. Oh, Keyboy, by the way, very nice. <laughs> nice, Rafaela. About to get caught. Uh, okay, he seems to be good. He's Wait, bottom lane though. Right Go catch bottom lane. You don't need five people at turtle. Four bottom tier one. No mamas. Overall, these traits are okay, but they're getting a little bit more in terms of. Damn, they really want to protect Oheb. That's going to be a turtle slain here by the STB. Radiant armor being purchased by Oh My Venus. Seven minutes now. They want to go for the mid lane push. Nah, this shit's over, bro. Onyx lost. If we look over to the mid lane here, you can tell that, you know, Blacklist, they really want to crack open this mid tier one. Unless they catch Kimi and Beatrix somehow. They are literally just waiting for the scaling to pop, right? They're just waiting for the power spikes. It is going to be a little bit more time until we see those items come up. But until then, it's no. really smart what they're doing. Even though they're four to one and the turrets are, and objectives have just been in favor of Blacklist, they you, have you, been able you to. You really think Oni got the blade game? A little bit only, but yeah, I mean, they do, but like, we just keep on trading we'll see. Until you hit those power they have zero farm on their Clint. You get those items, when you get those levels, just yeah. pull the trigger. Let me see. We'll see though. Like, both turrets are gone now. Kimi Lake is pretty strong too. I mean, if they go past 18 minutes, definitely on. Has chance. So in order to go to 18 minutes game, Onik really really needs to defend this mid turret and stop dying. Like these kinds of far ults is really really bad. Now far has no ult. I'm waiting for the blacklist. You know, are they going to be turned up or what? Yeah. Dude, Wise is level 12 to Sans is level 10. This is just going really Kimmy's well. just gonna take everything, bro. Kimmy's gonna take Turtle, Lord, Lord. the S Man is to back Basically out now, or he's gonna die. As well. And right now, sure, Onik, they are getting some trades, they are getting some gold back and some pressure. Okay, he got back. away. But in the end, honestly, if they're getting outscaled by the Kimmy, it's not all. Wait, they, they might go to late game. game. You're right. And they might go to late game. Can be taken by Blacklist International as the Turtle will spawn in five seconds. So will be the fourth but they cannot again. they cannot contest the turtle that's the thing so quickly that every two minutes you refresh it score is one zero blacklist so is winning that they, they are taking because look at this something that you can get out of the map from free the turtle minutes, right really? so blacklist international further increasing their lead this time and at nine minutes they want to group up to the middle Haji, Haji, he's finding one and he gets on top damn of the well, but it's gonna be damn Haji tz now some trouble feather air strike being held up still not the mid turret Beatrice is just focusing the turret. Ooh, that's an easy peasy. Guys, Onik looking like random. What is going on? Blacklist is this strong? This man, now I know, now you know. Then what, what does this match make BTK? Best team? I keep on looking at this flicker because every time he has it, he just makes things happen. If Onyx loses this, they're out. They're going home, bro. Looking at the performance so far, I don't think they deserve the airplane. They're swimming home. They're swimming back home. Ooh! Balorski! 
Oh! Oh! Okay! Finally, they're on the board. Some, you know, somewhere they're able to get a pick off onto Wise. That's gonna be really, Not bad. really good. Giving some time for Sans to scale back up. But now, finally, let's take a look at the items. Sans has that Blade of Despair yep. and that Hunter's Fury, whereas Wise already has a Glowing and the Ice Queen one, plus that Athena Shield to add more onto the defense. And this is just really scary. But they do so much damage, and they're just so, so tanky as well. Oheb is just like way too fat, my guy. And let me tell you, he never misses snipe. He was born to fucking snipe. Filipino sniper right there. Which allows for the defense so that he can really just man up and maybe take some hits before going down or before having to use his rollout. By the way, Oheb has been phenomenal with his sniper from back-to-back -back games. Also using it to actually siege from a distance where the turret will not be able to reach him and I think that this is the time where you say Bae oh, oh, we pulled out in a kimi they're going back oh. in Haji is looking for opportunities oh. and they've already used oh wait hold on hold did he just fly with Matilda now, into enemy and they didn't the engage booster, no, we don't see it bro if, if that was oh, Onyx they should just focus that kimi Sports, despite the engagement from what? Blacklist. Yeah, that was really, really uh, scary for a second for Blacklist International. Black, you know, Vitas, Hachi. he went in. Oh, oh he baby! Oh, my God. Mr. 3.0 pulling on with the RQ Arbert. Backline and punching Drian out of position. Oh, my Venus cannot capitalize more on this, but a good, Clint? good fight for the side of the Blacklist International. Oh, oh, oh. Hachi, Question mark? The MVP machine. I think they're waiting for 12. Bro, what? What happened to Sans? He's suffocated. Bro, Sans is doing nothing. Like literally nothing. Eventually gonna get items. And right now, one, zero, and four, five. Sans is just choking. We're with him, and just like that, Blacklist International waited for the 12-minute mark to attack the Lord this time, and Haji already positioning himself. This okay, Esma's grinding. Esma's grinding. Esma's grinding. First ultimate. Oh, oh if we got the Beatrix though. Oh, this would have been really good for Onik, but now they cannot push this. Can they? Can they? Can they? Oh, they can. Okay. That was really good for Onyx. That was enhanced Lord, right? Or was it not? That was enhanced. You know, Onyx, they, they, they understand. Oh, you use all your resources. Oh, it wasn't? To the Lord. Let's try to was. go for something right oh, now. It was? Okay. He's taken really low. He knows exactly that. Okay. Blacklist, they can't kill me. With the help of the Rock. The thing is, Onyx defense is really good. With Natan, Clint, and Farsa. They can easily defend this. Without losing any uh, inner turrets. Unless Haji pulls out another TikTok. Then different story. And Onyx, they need to now understand. Understand that this can keep on happening if they keep on doing this. Sans and CW and Drian, these three members, please play behind. Do not show yourself until oh. Haji has made a move. Oh, here we go. Luminous Lord gonna be crashing in towards uh, the top. Yeah, here easy defense. Really looking. Past good high ground defense so far, but Haji, three more seconds until his flicker comes back up, and then you know what's gonna happen here. Damn, what a stomp. He's going down, Boots still standing in the front line, making sure that he's blocking as many shots while he is still alive. We don't see much happening for Blacklist International. They're not going to engage. By the way, Haji Damn, they couldn't even get a single target off of that. Set up coming up from Blacklist International with Imagine. Damn, you guys are right. Onyx going for the late game. After the nine minute mark, which means that Haji can go for another maybe conceal. Mm -hmm. Or come on, perhaps, but perhaps perhaps they put the conceal on Haji in the favor on to Oh My Venus. Yeah, they can the Show them how they thick you are. But again, Onyx Esports is draft. This is where they shine, right? The defense. Uh, they, they noticed in game number one, they were just getting out, uh, the team fights were just not going in their favor. So now in this game with the draft, they want to play for the defense. It's very similar to the game against Onyx PH in Group B. Let's see if they're able to pull off the sim a similar comeback here. But at this point, it's very one-dimensional, but at least okay. uh, they have scales. Yep. Nice catch on that Oheb. Oheb had to flicker. Esmas keep chasing though, Matilda second skill, nice. Any sort of opportunity. Guys, this Kiri boy or something? Does not connect on anybody. He's looking pretty good on there, Rafaela. Not gonna lie. He about to do the flick roll again. Oh, that poke though. 
This is just so tense, man. Then Clint is gonna get the MVP if Oni Gabber wins this. Lord lead. I mean, they have everything on the board right now, but still, Oni. Imagine if Clint didn't get fucked early game. Oni got one right by now. Composition. They scale up now with CW. Damn. Only 2K gold lead. How? This might be the time where they can try to look for some company. Wait, how is Blacklist not leading like 6K, 5K? Losing one turret, basically, uh, on Blacklist International. Oh, help! Is, look at this. This is where you say, oh, why is this <laughs> How is this legal? Oh, why is this allowed? Well, he allows it, so... Yeah, oh, that should be illegal. It's one of those things where you're like, I guess oh, it's legal. But, but this might be a throw. They made a big mistake, maybe. So nah, Matilda's so second skill. Oh, hey, hey! Clint! Oi! 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 Paluski! 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 Paquito pushing bottom. But Paquito has zero damage on the turret. On the recall. That was beautiful. Again, on esports, they've been playing to their drafts perfectly. Sure, they have been losing out on the gold in and everything, basically, in the early stages. But that's Wait, what this looks a little shaky board. now, guys. You guys are right. Onig is pulling up late this game. This is what I mentioned. I set this up, and this is exactly what happened. They are playing it smart. They are playing it through the drafts. And now, look, the tides are starting. Balerski taking oh, notes right it's now. It's like, oh, that's how you play, Rafaela. <laughs> My man. Taking some aggressive notes. It is dead even when it comes to the gold already. The lead doesn't matter. And it means that on the esports will have Wait, a bit no of way they're doing Lord. The there is no is, way they're doing the this. They're Kimmy Ult! Huge Ult! Huge Ult! But they got Rafaela. Haji? Always be careful with Haji. That man's aggressive. But Haji got Haji got caught! Wait! Retry! 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 Wait! Pull that enough! But they got wiped! They got wiped! But this fight is over! Onyx Esports find what they were looking for! Blacklist International is on the run! Oh my god! We expected a banger and we're gonna get it, man! The Lord taken away for three members and look! Didn't hit the red tree right, but... This is a... Beatrice ultimate? Nice old, nice old. But Farsa is here. Yeah, they cannot push. They cannot push. They have to go top. And bottom. Pa top and bottom. It is very unlikely that Onyx Esports will get any bottom. Nice, nice, nice. Minions that's running through top and Wait, bottom, lane. bottom? And now it's dead even. It's going to be a question on who gets Bro, the only if hit the retro, right? Or maybe the better item. Paquito saves no, the day, huh? It's not, it's not, I don't think it's... Uh, Longer. I don't really think it's gonna be that anymore, man. I don't think it's the engage or the items or anything. Onik have simply just Blacklist is gonna get PTSD from Esme, bro. Is play the macro, all right? They need or Clint. The they already have. If not, if they just go for the five v five, that again, this is Blacklist style five v five. I don't think they're gonna win. They need to get very specific, yes. win, like very specific catches to be able to win these team fights. Yeah, you know why? Because all of the uh, magic defense is already up for Onik Esports, and that means that the Kimmy. Will not Damn, Oni might win. Their team comm is just better late. I mean, look at Onik Esports. The moment they find and Natana's immortality so now, far, it's really hard to kill him. Especially with this team comm so that has no mage, yes. but Even only Kimi. Which you will not get to um, so Natan, well most game, likely. Despite them trailing so heavily, and guess what? Boots hasn't died yet. He only has three assists. They already caught up with the gold. Actually, Onyx is ahead in gold now. How did they kill this Esme? Conceal? Maybe this could be a potential flicker coming in from Keyboy. Nope. He's just gonna back off. You know, in Ooh, nice snipe. A lot of the the Indonesian fans basically called Onyx Esports Boots Esports for the regular <laughs> season. The fact of the matter is, this man. He's the regular season MVP in MPL ID, and you can finally see why. He starts to shine when he's... Damn, Kiribo is good, good guys. And right now, he is literally the core. He's fucking the good. Sure the most damage won't come from him, but he is going to be... Everyone's playing yeah. around him. He is the frontliner. He's the sole one able to engage, able to make these plays and set up for his team. He's the anchor, definitely, for Arctic Esports. And not only that, in the early stages, when you saw the Blacklist internet... Kiribo, yeah. <laughs> the map, he didn't die while also taking care of the minion waves. Oi, oi. Oi! Oi! Oh, that's gonna ask me! Chow kick! Pocketo! Oh! 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 Oh!
impact. It's CW with that flicker out. Was gonna be consistent bombardment. What was the Esme thinking? Insane, honestly, very scary. CW still able to run away with the flicker. Actually, the immortality has not been popped yet, but Blacklist in that fight as well. Haji and and Edward, they got a really good pick. And as you can see, it still didn't work, right? Oh, the healing is too much, but wait a minute. Oh, oh, in, oh, 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 Blacklist! But no, this is bad. This is bad. They couldn't kill Nathan. Paquito's on Nathan, but Nathan. Oh, what a disaster. What a disaster. What a disaster. Game's over. Oh, no. Oh, that was beautiful, man. Beautiful oh no, Blacklist did it Sassy again. Trying to focus the hyper and too much and get and fucked. The they did that shit on Zane. And now Boots as well as the gang, they're on the run. Oh my goodness. Eh? Oh, that's going to be the Holy Baptism already on Blacklist. Lord? Question mark? The maximum impact lands on Wait, are they trying to end? He's getting confident. He's no way they're trying to end, right? Oh. Wait, they are. They are. Can we die? Oh my. Oh, Onik. Up, and they go for the finish. Onyx Esports pull into game three. GG. Blacklist well, choking? Happy V Sons, oh, baby. Blacklist oh, choking? That was insane. He literally just danced oh, his way. That was God. tap dancing, man. Oh, pixel perfect. Even there's just a little bit of opening from where Edward will be able to find the knockup, but he dodged that and wonderfully well. The way that what? they position themselves, they know exactly that. The Blacklist International wanted to get a kill out to Sands and they were prepared for it. Sands stood his ground. Eventually, the help was there. Boots was phenomenal with their initiation. Bro, that was a disaster. You know, How did they not kill the Natan? They finally 